Hi and welcome! In this video I will show you how you can create a useful sunglasses or glasses case in less than 30 minutes. Kiat is a sewing pattern designed by myself, tailored for beginners with very easy to follow step-by-step -step instructions. I will post links to where you can find the PDF sewing pattern with printable template in the description box down below. Are you ready? Let's get started! If you have printed your template, let's take page 3 and 4 and let's put them together. I generally fold one side of a page where indicated and I glue them together with a double-sided tape. I simply find this to be the most convenient way to build a printed PDF pattern template. If you prefer to create the template yourself, you will find the measurements in the description box. Once you have decided what size you would like to make, go ahead and cut. I created Kia to accommodate three types of glasses. Size S is perfect for your reading glasses or for smaller glasses frames. Size M is the way to go for your everyday glasses and size L is dedicated to all the oversized glasses frames. Let's move into cutting our fabric pieces. Starting with the outer fabric, we need to cut one piece. Make sure that you place the template in the right direction based on the fabric salvage. Place your paper template on the fabric, pin it safely and cut. Do the same for the fabric you choose for the lining. Be careful here, as in order to properly cut the lining, we need to tilt the paper template. I like to also use interfacing to add additional softness and to keep the glasses safe. I generally use Flizzeline 272 Thermolam, which corresponds to Pellon Thermolan Plus TP970. Time to start the construction of our glasses case. Line the outer side piece with the lining one, good sides together. Then add the interfacing on top of one of the two sides. Pin and sew it all around, making sure you leave an opening on one side. I use the bottom side in this case. Leave a seam allowance of around 1 cm or 3 8 of an inch. This is one of the steps that I suggest you never skip in any of your sewing project. Press the seams. It is one of the key steps to create sewing projects with a professional finished look. Now we want to trim our glasses case in order to remove bulkiness around the corners and the seams. I cut the corner first, paying very close attention to not cut the seams. Then I trim the interfacing layer. We are getting closer to the moment of truth. Making use of the gap we left open, turn the glasses case inside out. We 
With the help of a pointed item, insert it inside the sunglasses case and make sure that the corners are pushed out, as well as the sides. This step is fundamental for the next top stitching step. While pressing the case, make sure you fold toward the inside the part that we left open before. Press and pin. Let's go back to the sewing machine and top stitch all around the project. We are almost there, good job! Fold the case in half, making sure the sides are perfectly lined up. Pin it. Now sew together the line-up sides, using the same needle setup you use for the top stitching. The goal here is to stitch precisely on top of the existing seam. And voila, your glasses case is ready! If you like this video and enjoy making this project, please give it a thumb up and subscribe for more videos to come. Thank you and bye!